When you think of the word toast, what's the first thing that comes to mind? Probably a slice of bread pane, that's just popped out of the toaster. Tosta pane, covered in butter, burro, jam, marmellata, or peanut butter. Burro di arachidi. Toast isn't pronounced toast in Italian, but tost, with a long O sound. It's a masculine noun and invariable, meaning that it stays the same in the plural form. Toast. Although this meaning does exist in Italian, when a person talks about toast, they're almost always referring to two slices of lightly toasted white bread with some kind of savory filling like cheese, formaggio, and ham. Prosciutto. What we would call a toasty, toasted sandwich or grilled cheese sandwich in English. Ho mangiato un toast al bar prima di tornare al lavoro. I ate a toasty at the bar before heading back to work. As you might have guessed from the identical spelling, toast was borrowed from the English toast. So what if you want to tell your roommate all about that delicious single slice of toast you ate last night? In that case, it's best to use the expression una fetta di pane tostato or pane abbrustolito. Literally, a slice of toasted bread. Vuoi una fetta di pane tostato? C'è ancora un po' di marmellata in frigo. Do you want a slice of toast? There's a bit of jam left in the fridge. And if the slice of toasted bread comes from a baguette, ciabatta, or loaf of sourdough, you should use the term crostino, literally little crust, instead. Grazie per averci seguito. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.